Today's topic. All right, guys. So today's topic. We are back with another video. I'm sure you can see the thumbnail. So you know what we are going to talk about. So, I won't take any much time. So without further talking, man, let's start cooking. first um whew, i'll be honest i kind of like um her approach to be honest yes i kind of like her approach because she doesn't come off as a i would say desperate but yeah i mean you know most women are not able to do what she just did and that right here would make her more attractive to a man than a girl who is than a woman who is just sitting on the other side and then keep on giving you eye contact um because guess what us men we also like when women actually we also like when a woman actually decides to approach us if you don't believe me ladies you can try it out but your approach is what's gonna make the difference so know how to approach men that is very good let's move on what's that way what's the way you want to uh i would want to be able to make her a priority i don't think i can do that right now so you're not scared of like missing out on the right girl let's say you meet me today and you think i'm the right girl and you're not gonna talk to me because you don't have really a lot of time like to meet me so you're not gonna talk to me at all Did she just use that? So what she did was uh, <laughs> What she did was kind of cheesy though because what it means is she's trying to tell you hey uh, I'm right here. I'm a great woman and uh, I'll be great for you so by saying okay, so I'm right here and uh, and you kind of find me attractive, you wouldn't talk to me. You know, here's why, because when I say that, sometimes I'm talking to some of, some of my friends uh, that are girls, and I'm trying to take an example, just like a random example, like, I'm not, like, literally. And I say, so, let's say you and I were together, and, and then the first person that she gets is, oh, no, 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 don't use me, use somebody else. And I'm like, oh, fine. Okay, let's say you and, I don't know, some random name, Bob, were together. You see, what it does is, in her mind, when you say to her, let's, let's say, for example, you and I were together, that, now she's thinking, oh, I think he likes me. And so, what she would do is, oh no, don't use me as, a, as an example with you, use somebody else. So, what you do is, Instead of using another girl with you, just pair up with a random man. Mean, meaning that you don't really care who is she with, basically. So when she did that, when she said, well, let's say you find me attractive, or I think that's what she said, 
meaning that she already, oh, of course, she finally reached out to him, but she would like to actually get to know him. You know? And then she tried to tell him, hey, I'm right here, get to know me. Don't bypass me because you are not, because you don't want uh, a relationship right now. At least give me a try. But that, that's actually so far, that's a great approach. That I'm, I'm going to give her like a, a 10 for that, like a 10, uh, meaning like out of 10, because she knows how to actually start a conversation. That's great. So far, she's doing a good job. But let's see if she gets hurt or if she understands the, the logic behind his mentality. Let's move on. Well, if you're the right girl, but I treat you wrong because I don't necessarily have the time to devote you that I wanted to, then I don't think I would do either of us a good service. That sounds really good. Usually guys are not like that. They, they kind of lie and they kind of act like, oh no, I have time for you. And then once they get what they want, they just kind of like disappear. Yeah, not that nah, time. yeah. I just wouldn't get involved. I don't think I would be. How old are you? I'm 29. 29. Oh. You have kids? Nope. You want kids? I don't know. <laughs> you don't know? Okay, that's, that sounds good. So what do you... Okay. Now, look at this, guys. That's a great response, man. Always try to use his line. That's a great response. That's a way for him to reject her in a... Well, in a good way. Meaning, it, do, it doesn't come as, oh, yeah, you're not good for me. But, of course, that's, what, that's, actually, that's actually not what he's saying anyways. But, like myself, um, so, he, he, he understands that, hey, I want to have my life together. I mean, he already has his life together. Um... I assume, but I'm sure he's going to talk about that in the video. Uh, but he is like, no, I don't want to get a girlfriend because if I do, I'm going to have to make her a priority. Now, here's the problem with that. Making a woman a priority is not a great thing. And that's when I think that he doesn't sound like a player to me, but he, I, I think he could be a player if he wanted to. But um, one thing I, I think he had the mistake he made is to make a woman a priority. I don't think you should make a woman a priority unless she's your wife. If she's your girlfriend, fiance, no. Because at this point, there is, uh, you, do, you, you have no commitment in a sense. When I say commitment, meaning, when I say commitment, I'm talking about a marriage vows, you know? But if you're a girlfriend and you can leave at any time. If you are a fiance, you can leave at any time. It's just for marriage, I don't think it's a great idea to leave because God's plan was for them to be one. Now, he, as a man, we should always put ourselves first. Meaning, now, when I'm talking, about, when I'm talking outside of marriage, so that's that. Uh, why? Because you want to make sure you are getting better for yourself. Not for your girlfriend or your or your fiance, even your wife. You wanna be better for yourself because the better you get, the better you can you can actually get everybody else to be. So, if you want a better job in your field, you have to get better at the job. You have to put more time. You have to stay late. You have to take the time to go to the conferences, to events and talk to people that, are, that have connections. Those are the things that you have to do to get yourself better. And by doing this, she's going to get better naturally. But if you put her as a priority, then you're going to try to get her better without you getting better. So it's that's probably the only mistake so far that he has made. But so far, the, it's a great conversation that they're having. And... I kind of like the idea that I kind of like the idea that she's not actually butthurt that he's not interested in a girlfriend at the moment. But let's move on. Let's keep it going. What do you do 
that makes you feel like you're too busy to be in a committed relationship. So now she's asking him, what do you do that makes you so busy that you are not able to get into a relationship? Let's see. Uh, I'm just in transition right now. Okay. So I uh, graduated from grad school last year. Got a job in the field I went to school for, okay. but it's not necessarily enough to fill. That and it's not necessarily paying me what I would hope okay. for it to. Uh, so I made enough connections in that industry to be able to like keep a foot in it while okay. I have a job that can support me like financially as well. So I'm I mean, just trying that's to totally do both. Yeah, I know that challenge. <laughs> Alright, so, oh, actually, wait a minute. We're gonna Asian. Asian, no one. Colin is on. Like, 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 we're coming. We're coming. We're coming for you. Oh, shit. You're here. It's fine. Your hair is fine. I know. Look at this thing. Is it? Can we sing happy birthday? Happy birthday. Thank you. It's his birthday. Oh, happy birthday. Oh, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Her birthday was October 30th. Mine was November 2nd. Thank you. Okay. Thank you so much. Oh, wow. I hear an accent. All right. So I think that's the that's the actually that's the video. I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop right here because there's nothing else after that. Um. So guys, the last thing that she that he actually mentioned was really great. So she asked him. Now the other girl I jumped in asking, well, why, what makes you so busy that you are unable to have a girlfriend? And now I'm gonna be honest though. I think so far she's been 100% honest. Uh, I don't think he was lying or making things up in a way to push them. Actually, you see, he didn't even push him at all. He just talked to them as if just a conversation. I want to be honest. That's an A plus conversation right here. Uh, that was a great conversation. But his answer was, uh, I finished school. I'm working in the field that I studied for. But I'm not making the money that I would like to be making. So I'm in a transition to get a better one by connecting with people that have connection, basically. And... There are certain way you phrase your sentence that will give the other person, okay, this guy, or oh, I'm pretty sure they already knew he's, um, he's a great catch. And I'm probably sure all three of them are actually interested in him. Now, that's me speculating thing. It's not for sure. So I don't really know. But um, the the one thing I, I noticed is they were only talking to him and not to the other guys. <laughs> you see, um, most black girls don't want to go with other races. They want to stay with black men, which I'm okay with that. And most of, but most of them don't know how to actually start a conversation with a man. And I think that's the disfavor we do in women these, these days, because um, they always talk about, even my mom, she said that too, she's like, well, your sister, she has to wait for a guy to talk to her. I'm like, ha, mom, it's 2021. That thing is expired. You see, <laughs> that thing is expired, ladies. You have to start knowing, okay, I want a man, I want to talk to him. I would like to get him to I would like to get I would like to get to know him better. Well guess what? You're gonna have to come to the man. You're gonna have to find a way to say hi. How are you? How was your day? You know, but the way she came was pretty good, I'll be honest. It wasn't uh and I, I think his reaction to made it made it made her actually uh appreciate that she actually came to him yeah but i don't know who these girls are i don't know but that was a great video i like his responses uh according to why he's not in a in the dating market right now 
except that he wants to make the woman a priority, which I don't think is a great thing to do. It's not bad, but I wouldn't advise men to do that. I would advise them to actually, yeah, make time for your make time for women for your girl or all that. But to make her a priority is not actually a, a great thing to do because she's supposed to be the leader and she's supposed to be following you. Anyways, guys, this was TOV, the Open Girl TV. I hope to see you guys again. Until then, I'm out.